and to get out of the, again the, the, the footwork of this guy that's as good as a run that's going to start drawing safeties and linebackers up. First turnover of this game. Breeze on first and tenth of the 26 complete. The tight end David Thomas Stephen Nicholas right there to make the tackle loss of three. Guys are going to come open in this league. Another outstanding throw and catch for the Carolina Panthers. Just coming off that edge. Nice loop back underneath. Nice legal hit. And right now, the young Mr. Ponder's not seeing coverage very well because that thing should have been picked. You're going to see there's basically going to be a wall right here and nobody left. Now, good luck trying to tackle number seven once he gets in space out there. Mike is just picking his spots for running tonight. He is turned into the pocket passer. Butler quick out to Devin Hester. And it's lofted again by the Falcons tackles a year ago. And the Bears will punt it away. First down at the 35. Handoff to Williams. And down he goes in a hurry. Thanks to Stephen Nicholas, a pickup of one. One timeout left for the Steelers. Dixon stepping up goes underneath to Moeldi Moore, who's uh, tackled by Stephen Nicholas. It is a throwback. Frank Gore. Not much. And now the Falcons seem to have taken the momentum away. Stephen Nicholas passing. Alex Smith and a good catch by Gore. And he is uh, put down after a gain of four yards by Stephen Nicholas. Behind by three. DeLong's pass. That's complete again to Watson. Nicholas right with him. It will bring up second down. Third and 19. Well short of the first down. Three catches for Crabtree Charles. And there is the swing pass to Delaney Walker. He beats a defender. And finally. Brought down by the linebacker Stephen Nicholas. Freeman. Up to the 42 yard line. Behind head coach Mike Smith. Watching Atlanta's defense against Jake DeLone, who completes the Hillis, but is short of the first down. Freeman. And the pass caught at the 31 by Williams, and Stephen Nicholas quickly brings him down. A minimal gain of two. In the pistol package, they call it their Mountaineer package. He's a wide receiver playing quarterback, and it does nothing to fool the Atlanta Falcons. The throw to Geddes quickly tackled by Nicholas, and that will be fourth down. Just as you called, Dick, put pressure in his face. John Abraham off the edge. Then coming up the middle, Stephen Nicholas, who played his college football on this field. All right, thank you very much. Here's the pitch to Jonathan Stewart. Stewart, down he goes, Stephen Nicholas, and there'll be a loss of five yards. I'll remember that, and so will our audience, as the Bucks return the second half kick, Spurlock. And Spurlock. Take a look here, guys. One, two, three, four, five. I mean, they had about nine people in the box, and that allowed them to overpower the Jets blocking. And then watch at the end. There's a chop block out in open field. That's Jeremy Zuta knocking him down. Across the middle. That's Donald Lee. From the 20 yard line, D'Angelo Williams looking for an opening. Nothing there. Stephen Nicholas and his friends. Freeman goes short to Chris Presley, the rookie fullback, and he's. Set down immediately by Stephen Nicholas for a gain of one, so it's fourth down. Showing the zone defense. Check down underneath. That's Jackson. That's not even close. And a few boos come out here in Green Bay. 21 yard line on first down. Manning, the boss again. Stephen Nicholas, the tackle. Drive start from the nine with a flag down. Breeze has a shot. Off the hands of Shockey and almost intercepted by Stephen Nicholas, but he couldn't bring it in. Backside pressure and a quick throw nearly picked off. Stephen Nicholas all over Painter. 
much different from the first half. And that's a catch. That's the rookie, Jermichael Finley. He got a couple. Early here in the second. And there is a sack. Stephen Nicholas on the rollout. Chased down Cam Newton. And there'll be a loss of three on the play. Boy, for Stephen Nicholas. That's huge. <laughs> when he kicked that down the middle, I could not believe it. I thought he was going again. He stepped up like he had a lane. Abraham, excuse me, 55, John Abraham, pushing the pocket back into Jake DeLome and helping cause that, in it, that, 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 that interception by Stephen Nicholas. And it hit the helmet of, it looked like, Alex Mack. They go spy here with Stephen Nicholas. And his assignment is just to mirror Mike Pick wherever he may go. He has no pass responsibilities. And so he's going to run around and try and make the play. But there he is to pick it up afterwards. Great play by John Abraham coming in there and getting that strip. Now the Falcons have it at the 50 yard line. We got our first pressure here. Also one on one on Karimi. Yep. Gets to the outside. Ball thrown. I think he's got a legitimate. The 44. And Freeman's pass incomplete. And that was Stephen Nicholas putting the surge on Freeman. If this Atlanta Falcons defense came to play, you're getting numbers to the ball, and they're getting there with a bad attitude. Getting through. They weren't happy with the way they tackled down in Tampa. Working on the outside with John Abraham. Starts to beat him around the corner. He pulls him down. We're going to throw it on first down. And they set up the screen to have it read beautifully by Steven Nichols. Breeze rolling, firing left. And that one is caught, but for a minimal gain to Pierre Thomas. Steven Nicholas with the tackle. Steven Nicholas is going to get the tip on the football. You're taught to read a quarterback's eyes, and that's exactly what he does. He gets good depth. He reads the eyes of Jimmy Clausen and he provides a layup for Mike Peterson. Back to back slant type routes. And that ball's thrown pretty well, but Steven Nicholas doing a nice job in coverage, and it could be argued. Bulger being rushed. They got him. Steven Nicholas, the second year linebacker out of South Florida, in for the sack. This is one of those plays that when it starts off poorly, sometimes you just have to take your medicine and eat the football. And right there, that's what Jake DeLome should have done. Obviously ill-advised. This is not one that is going to the come close to turning out well. down by contact. Well, that's one thing the New York Giants have to go and identify is when they're going to bring that pressure. Steven Nicholas right there comes in. That's the fifth man. That's going to be the, dif the, uh, the difference in today's game. When they bring that pressure, Eli's got to go and dump that ball off like we saw earlier. Off of the play fake. They want to try and get the ball to number 81, Dustin Keller, working downfield against Steven Nicholas. He covers it very well and then makes a play on the football. Keller trying to beat him to the flag. Nicholas right on top of it. Steven Nicholas knocked it out right there. Brent Grimes picked it up, and instead of a big third down conversion by Jennings in Green Bay, turnover, Atlanta has it.